Such a dick move. Also, it's like he sleeps in so late. I feel like we have to do something about this, you know? Yeah, for sure. This is for the better. We're trying to help you, Mike. This one might be too far. It might be. Yeah, this is definitely borderline. We're not gonna shoot too many times. Yeah, it's gonna hurt. No, no, please no. Did Mike get up yet? It's like one o'clock. That, that's the point of the paintball oh, gun, Ken. Yeah, let's, let's go. Ken, do you wanna do it? Ken, do it. It's ready, but shh, shh. You gotta do this delicate. Ken, be careful now. You gotta hit him in the ass, not in the eyeball. I'm not that much of an asshole. No, no, we're not talking about you being an asshole. We're talking about you being a bad aim. Yeah. Can you know how to shoot that? Yeah, it is. You literally just pull the trigger. And it's Hold gonna shoot. Yeah, it's a fucking paintball gun, you idiot. Do you think I don't know how to shoot a paintball gun? Yes! Shh, now shut the fuck up. Ken! Oh my god! Oh my god! I guess get one clean back shot. Right now? Oh! Ow! Jeez. Jeez. He's bleeding. Jeez, Ken. I am, I am sorry about that. That is my bad. <laughs> Dude, you might have bent it. Sorry, my bad. Anyway, uh, special delivery. Oh man, this actually looks legit. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> what is this? It's a go-kart, Ken. <laughs> it's a go-kart, but now that I'm looking at it, I don't think you're gonna fit inside of it. Anyway, uh, you guys absolutely love the, what would we call this? No, honestly, we've just been doing a lot of Amazon testing lately, and this is the next thing on the list. Yeah. We're just doing it for the people. Yeah, I'd say that's <laughs> mostly what we're doing it for is the people. We just wanna make sure you're, you're purchasing good products. You know, this looks extremely familiar. When Ryan and I were kids, when we were driving one of these, that was the first time Ryan tried to kill me. Almost got away with it too. How many times he tried to kill you, Ken? You at least context to that. At least five now. Jesus. Okay, the go-kart. Cutlass. The cutlass. Ryan, I feel like you were trying to kill yourself that time. <laughs> <laughs> Let's right. pull this thing in. Let's do this. Right there. Perfect. Love that noise. A lot of you guys may notice there's a half deassembled smart car in the background. Dress the elephant in the room. Next video. Maybe. Actually, well, the way this smart car build is going, probably a couple videos, but if you're lucky, next video. Yeah, so basically, Ben and I have been working on this smart car for the past like two weeks now, and we keep having implications come up where we have to order parts and the parts take a while, so that's why this video has not dropped yet. time we unbox one of these Amazon toys, they always turn out to be like, I'd say probably half scale. <laughs> like 50% of what we were expecting. The cool thing is, if this go-kart doesn't get destroyed, we can just order like beefy ass shocks that fit this lane. What do you, what do you yeah, this thing's getting destroyed. Get, Mike, what are you Wait, talking about? <laughs> bro, have, have you watched any of the videos? <laughs> if it doesn't, then we have I'm not the, done our I'm job. The, <laughs> All right, do the honors, Mike. Oh, we're good. Or at least Mike is good. This is the concussion chamber 3000. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> hey, Ken. Oh, man. Ken, you gonna fit? Nope. Why? <laughs> 
I mean, besides for the obvious. I'm too big. My head hurts from like literally hitting this. Yeah, we should just take this off. Perfect. All right, I think we're good to go. on this thing than on your pit bike. I think I might be too. <laughs> yeah. I come out for the 110 pit bike races and I'm like, this is allowed. <laughs> dude, this Bro. thing rips. Dude, this I, thing does I, I, rip. I just lost like all my power. Was this always cracked? I Bro. literally, I got like three inches of air. The only way this will run is if you push that manifold down onto it so that no air gets in. So Ryan's just gonna be the push down guy. <laughs> this is so actually kind of dialed. It looks terrible, but it's, it's pretty dialed. Okay, so here's the test to see if it's truly the ultimate Amazon machine. All right, Ryan, take the pedal down. Perfect. All right, I'm uh, probably gonna get down at the bottom of the jump. Oh no. Oh. That, uh, yeah, it kind of sucked. All right, we gotta do a take two. Right. Oh, oh shit, here we go. Oh no. <laughs> you just started it up and then it just started going? Yeah. That's pretty sweet, yeah. actually. There he goes again. Oh no. Hook in it, Mike. Come on, Mike, you gotta be faster. You gotta be faster. <laughs> oh, oh, there you go. Oh shit. Come on, Mike. <laughs> Alright, so it's been uh, officially 12 hours since Ken lit Mike up with a paintball gun. Looks like I got bit by like a zombie. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, dude! Look at, Look at that. that. Just cheat. <laughs> So every year in the fall, we hope that the ice freezes before the snow flies so they can get clean ice. And right now there's no snow outside and the lakes are all freezing over in a glazed perfect ice. We were kind of prepared this year and we got these uh, little studs. I, but I, dude, I have a very hard time believing that these are gonna actually get traction. Cause from my understanding is you can literally just screw it into the top, right? Yep, and then the very tip of that is made out of like carbide but it's so small. So that's a this? Cool thing. It doesn't really dull, but it's not necessarily sharp to begin with. I don't know if it's gonna get any traction. It's such a time commitment to do it from the inside because you gotta put like nuts on it. Mm -hmm. So I hope that it works like this. Oh, that actually is kind of good. Without popping the tire. So yeah, we'll uh, throw these in and then take it out to do some testing. boys so we did a little bit of ice check-in looks like we're working with like six inches pretty sure you're good to walk on like two no maybe four either way it's gonna be fine oh it's definitely slippery oh yeah it worked you're golden
Oh, they're fine, bro. Do you feel like you're losing traction? No, the back tire is honestly okay. Just holding air. Has a yeah, you're good, bro. Yet. Yeah, dude. The front is just the front just ruins it. Like it makes it so sketchy. Should we just test the map? Yeah. Ryan, I'm gonna go with no. Well, you don't have. I'll do it. I mean, definitely don't come this far out. But you guys look like a committee. Let me be a part of this. Yeah, I'm gonna say no. I'm gonna say this Maverick shouldn't be out here. Yet. Yet. All right, right now you say your line. No. No. It's a no for me. All right. Yeah, and Ken's committee has spoken. <laughs> Ken's committee. <laughs> Oh man. Oh, Mike, it's making weird noises, the ice. Oh, I don't know, Mike. The ice is cracking, bro, bad. Don't give up on your dreams. If Ken tells you no, don't take no for an answer. Yeah. So we found out that we need more studs in your bike. Yeah. All, a bunch of studs in the Maverick. A lot of them. Just all together. Yeah. All of our other toys while we're at it. Comment down below um, what we should stud out of all the toys in the shop. And then uh, if you guys liked it, we'll do it again. Good. <laughs> Oh my god. Like the number one rule with paintballs is like no point blank skin shots. And Ken's like, I'm gonna take out all the revenge I've ever gotten on the paintball gun on Micah's thigh. Alright, we're on we're on maybe the wrong channel for this. Look at this, they're beating him up. Get him! Uh, <laughs> Pull him the other way, let's drag him around! <laughs> Man, someone's really got to pull that before the ice freezes.